I have a great concern and my heart actually aches for a lot of young people today because the economy is so sluggish, it's so difficult. Inflation, they're talking about recession. You know, let economists handle all those things. But my heart breaks sometimes for young people that are afraid or even anybody in the culture that's concerned about what's gonna happen with me? How do I survive in this sluggish economy? How am I gonna make it? Listen, I wanna share with you a word to encourage your heart. It sounds really simple, but it's so true. The Lord will provide for you. If you seek first the kingdom of God, if you seek first the Lord and His righteousness, He said, all these things I will take care of and provide for you. He even said, look at the flowers of the field, look at the lilies, look at the birds. They don't figure all this stuff out. They're not worried or anxious about it, but I even take care of them. And if there's one thing I've seen is when there's a bad economy, and when there's people that are losing their job, like jobs like in the economy we're experiencing right now in the tech industry, people panic. But you don't need to panic because God is your source. Trust the Lord in, with all your heart. Don't lean on your own understanding. In everything you do, in all your ways, acknowledge Him, really acknowledge Him, and He's gonna direct your path. He's got your back. You're gonna be okay. Can I pray with you today? Father, I thank you that you have an answer for every one of life's problems and crises that we go through. And Lord, you're concerned about the details of our lives. You really are. Someone right now that might be panicking, thinking, I don't know what to do. Lord, let them reach out in faith and know, God, that you've got them in the palm of your hand and no one's going to pluck them out of your hand. Lord, provide for those that are in need. Give them a heart to trust you. And God, you will always come through for us because you love us. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Don't panic, my friend, it's gonna be okay.